yeah, I'm going to start with the butt. Yeah. So, welcome to Attack It Adventures today. This is a sculpture. What was it called? We're at the Art of Museum in Raleigh, North Carolina. And it's Ladelmo, South African born, 71, lives in the United States, Collapse 1 made out of concrete and steel. It's a massive human form lining on its side and it's a monument that has toppled over. I'll go around it so you can see it. So collapse one. And I'll tell you why what made me come here in a few minutes. Welcome to Attack and Adventures today. Today we came here uh, because I was at a restaurant and when I looked to the wall, I seen these rings and it said that these rings were in North Carolina and I never knew about it. So we came to the art museum in North Carolina in Raleigh and this is what the rings look like behind me. And when I look at it, it reminds me of the Johnny Cash song, The Ring of Fire. So come in t today and attack the day with me and look at the sculptures outside of the art museum. So this is the links right now. And we'll go through them here in a minute. I'll take the video through. So I'm going to go walk through the rings. Here we go. It's busy here at the museum today on the grounds and inside. Hey, up here. Up here. Up here. This is concrete colored with iron oxide, reinforced with steel, molded with dirt residue from earth casting. And it is used as a Sari used a backhoe to dig three elliptical trenches that he filled with concrete and steel. After a month, the crane lifted each ring from the ground and lowered it into place. Iron oxide was used to color the concrete and dirt embedded in its surface. So I have Irene and Brian with me today. They've been wanting to come back here. They've been telling me about it. They've, I don't think y'all have been on the nature tra trail, have you, yet? Just inside the museum itself. This is a pretty big place, so if you're in North Carolina, if you're visiting North Carolina, come check it out. Yeah, it's been so pretty good so far. Here is a picture of the guy that did the rings in the middle of the forest of the trail that we're doing.
This image features Thomas Saray, who created here the three large rings in the museum park. The camouflage blends seamlessly with its surroundings, creating a surrealistic atmosphere that hides him in plain sight. They're highlighting how the arts in America have faced threatening erasure. He emphasizes the essential relationship these artists have with the community, integrating them into our own landscape. We're coming up on a windmill. Okay, there's Irene and Brian very in there and I'm standing on a bridge and supposedly we're at the same height as each other when they're way over there and I'm way over here and to get you a perception this is how far away they are Gotcha. So this concludes Attack Adventures today. I hope y'all enjoyed it. And y'all go attack the day in your neighborhood. <laughs>